Hi, I'm Shirley Burris from Burris Country Kitchen and you're here in my kitchen today. We're going to show you some exciting information on the dry product that we have. You know that we already have the uh, Brazilian shiitake Brazilian burger already frozen for you, but today we want to introduce it in a new way, in an easy way for you to do it into your kitchen for yourself. As you know, Patty Up is, is a product that's made from, it's a meat alternative. It is made from shiitake mushrooms, Brazil nuts, cashews, almonds and other wonderful uh, herbal ingredients, all completely pure, no additives, no preservatives, it's gluten-free, it's vegan, it's vegetarian, and it, it looks like this. It is just a, a beautiful product. You, you want to look at it, you want to taste it, and it smells good. It doesn't smell like chemicals, It's because it is not made from plant chemicals. It is made from meat, nuts, and shiitake. And so it's marketed like this, in a, a large or a small or you can buy it frozen as a, as a prepared burger uh, as well. But today I wanna to show you uh, how to take this product and turn it into this beautiful hors d'oeuvres for the holidays that can please everybody, whether you have vegan guests or whether they have vegetarian or sometimes you have meat eaters in the group, people who wanna eat seafood. And so you can bring out a display like this made from one simple step and this product instantly made, frozen, and ready to pull out before your guests get there and decorate just like this. And that all being done for $10. So everybody, everybody's happy and, and, and you're happy because you made a product that made other people happy and it's easy to do. So that's what we wanna show you today is how, how to mix that up and how to fry it and how to freeze it and how to please your company. Okay, so let's let's mix it together and show you how easy it is to do this. You can't do it wrong. It, it, it's very forgivable, but you're going to pat down that whole three-fourth cup per recipe. If you're using this, just open and dump it in. It's already measured at three-fourth cup. All we're going to do is add a fourth cup of water, two eggs, and one tablespoon of oil. It's that easy. I'm going to make it with an egg alternative, so we have a vegan product that you can please that your friends that are vegan as well. And all you do is take the egg replacement and that product it's two tablespoons of egg replacement to four tablespoons of water. And now here you have made an egg. <laughs> and um, that you leave set for a couple couple seconds or just keep stirring it up. I put, the, put that in first, uh, mix it up good like that. And then you will dump that right into your patty up dry mix just like that and now you have made an egg and one fourth cup of the water and one tablespoon of oil of your choice i like olive oil or coconut oil and then you stir it and that's it now you have instant ground meat alternative this would be like your ground beef or ground veal or ground turkey and it will do anything that that product will do. Anything you want to make with it, whether it's meatballs, meatloaf, or today we're using, we're making the little hors d'oeuvre patties, the little sliders. And that's how it looks. You just let that set for about five to 10 minutes and it'll, it'll look like that right there. Okay. Just like that. And now we'll show you how to fry it up. Okay, so here we are, we have the oil heating. I like the coconut oil because it has a high burn rate. I like the stainless steel because I think it's, it gives a pure finished product. The secret to that is getting it to that smoky uh, element where it's, it's hot. And then you just take, I take a scoop like this. If you want to make them big, make them large. These are the little hors d'oeuvre size or the meatball size. And you just drop that in a pan of hot, hot oil. And that's all you do when it's finished, flip it over and cheese it if you like. But um, remembering that this product doesn't have oil, it has fat in it because there's good fat. Fat is good brain food and it's good for your memory, but this product has it from nuts. So your nut, it becomes your fat, your nut meat. So you're going to have to add oil to it when you fry it up because there's no, there's no oil in it. So this is how it looks, it's just that simple. As soon as that's finished, flip it over and then you would end up with a product like this. So you can go ahead and make them a head like that and freeze it. And the kids can get that out of their freezer and pop that, you can even put it in the microwave because again, it's gluten-free. 
you don't have that problem with the, glue, the gooey taste to it. And then you have these instant. Put it on a salad, pasta, make your little hors d'oeuvres like we showed you earlier and dress them up. So you just get this out of the freezer. If you want them warm, you can nuke them or re-saute re them. If you want to serve it hot, it's best that way. And then dress it up.